All right, guys, I'm gonna show you the side bend. So starting position, your heels are under your armpits, toes are pointed forward, your hips are through, your shoulders are back. You've got 50 or 60 pounds in your, in your hand. Uh, if that feels too heavy, go lighter, but 50 or 60 for most of us should be good. And then I want you just to lean opposite the kettlebell in the beginning. You're gonna go to, the, go to end range, pinch, make sure you squeeze the oblique, and then come back. Over and pinch, come back. After you've done about six or seven of them, switch to the other side, over and pinch, come back. So six or seven for warm up is good, and if you're doing conditioning, you can hit 10 or 15 and work them to fatigue. But don't do that in the beginning of your workout because you need your core. Uh, if you feel a pinch in your side, um, or when you're leaning, you feel your pelvis rotating, or for any reason you don't strictly feel this movement right here. A lot of times if people aren't feeling the movement in their oblique, they'll feel it in their low back. Uh, that's a good indication that something's not right. Usually I find the quadratus lumborum, the QL is tight, so go find your massage therapist friend, have them release your QL, and immediately after that, go do the side bend. Have a good time with it, guys. <laughs>